Stop us if you've heard this one before, because it's becoming a more frequent refrain by the day, but Donald Trump just had a rather horrible day. Michael Cohen gave three suitcases of evidence to Congress, two of Trump's current lawyers have already been incriminated as a result, and we don't even know what else is in those magic suitcases. Trump appears to be pretty darn scared of it all. Shortly after Michael Cohen finished testifying for the day, by which time Trump attorneys Jay Sekulow and Rudy Giuliani were left contemplating life behind bars, Donald Trump had nothing left to do but run his mouth. Unfortunately for Trump, he couldn't come up with anything remotely coherent to say. Donald Trump posted this bizarre tweet, quoting one of his remaining allies, Congressman Chris Stewart, no one is accusing the president of a crime and yet they, the Democrats, are issuing hundreds of subpoenas. This is unprecedented. They are desperately trying to find anything they can, even a punctuation mistake in a document. Wait, what? Where do we even start with this? First of all, everyone is accusing Donald Trump of a crime. Second, if we were locking people up for punctuation errors, Trump would already be in solitary confinement. In reality these crimes include insurance fraud, money laundering, bribery, bank fraud, wire fraud, obstruction of justice, and conspiracy against the United States. Finally, it's notable that Trump is quoting one of his shrinking number of congressional allies, 13 GOP congressmen, and as many as 15 GOP senators are voting against Trump's national emergency.